That's right. You know, we are in the last few days of early voting, and this Wake County woman says she voted in Wake County for the last several years and never had a problem. That is until this year. Wow. Out of the whole Wake County, I'm the only one that's deleted? Phyllis Thomas shocked to hear her name not found as a registered voter when she showed up to early vote. They told me I could do a paper ballot, and I told them I didn't want to do a paper ballot. I wanted to vote regularly. She says staff at her early voting site did not argue with her and said they would get to the bottom of it. They made a lot of phone calls to find out what went on, and she said, somebody deleted you from the system. She said there was an error. I said, okay, but um, that's a big error. Besides casting her vote, Phyllis's other concern. My issue is how many more people were deleted from the system. So it's not just about me. If I didn't go early vote, and I waited for November, was I able to vote? I got in touch with the North Carolina Board of Elections and they confirmed Phyllis was mistakenly removed from the Wake County voter rolls in January. The representative said this happened after her name showed up as a possible duplicate registration through routine automated checks for duplicates. The reason, the representative says, Phyllis's name, date of birth, and gender match exactly with the voter in another county. I said, I'm not leaving here. I came here to vote, and I want to vote the way I've been voting all along. And so that's what I wind up doing. Election officials on site work with Phyllis to register again and vote successfully, just like she's done in the past. So she did get to vote after all. Now, State Board of Elections says this is a rare isolated incident that unfortunately can't happen as a check for duplicate registrations in a database with 7.5 million voters. The representative adds even if this happened on Election Day to a voter under state law, any registrant who is removed from the voter rolls will be reinstated if they meet certain conditions. I just have to say that. So in the end, she got to vote. Good. She just want to make sure this did not happen to anyone else. Confusing and frustrating when you show up and you think it's going to be yeah. easy. Yeah. So. so. She got to vote if it happens to you. Yeah. <laughs> Diane, thank Good you. Good job, Diane. Thank you.